Three years ago, I posted a video showing a different way to hang Christmas lights. After posting it, I basically forgot about it, and two and a half years later, some friends said, Have you seen your YouTube channel? You have almost a million views on your video. So, I have to start by saying, thank you for watching, and thanks to everyone who left comments. I couldn't believe the response this video received. Let me answer some of the most frequent comments I've received. First of all, the number one comment by far was the notion that this took way too long and it would be faster to just use traditional gutter clips. Three things I would say about that. Number one, as I said in the original video, I'm very particular about having the lights evenly spaced and every light in a clip. For those of you who can string your lights in 15 minutes, you either live in a tiny home or you are not putting every light in its own clip and keeping all the lights pointed in the same direction. Second, my HOA definitely will not allow standard lights with clips to be left on the house throughout the year. By about the second week of January, they begin harassing everyone whose lights are still showing. And finally, and maybe most important, it was a lot of work to put these up, but I have never taken them down. I simply swivel the pipes so the lights disappear under the eaves and then swivel them back down in November when I'm ready to have the lights displayed again. The second most common comment was several people asking about drilling the holes first and then cutting the pipe. That's actually how I tried to do it the first time around. I ran into two different challenges. The first one was, it was surprisingly hard to saw the pipe in a perfectly straight line following all the drill holes. And second, the holes are not much bigger than the width of a table saw blade, so by the time you've removed that material, there isn't much hole left to hold the sockets for the bulbs. And finally, the third comment that I saw a lot of is many viewers pointing out that I had done all this work and spent the time to post a video and there wasn't a single shot of the lights actually displayed at night. Major oversight on my part, sorry about that, and here you go.